higher level learning, we've studied each individual single oil and each individual blend available through Jade Bloom. Now you're ready to take the next step in your education in making your own blends. In this video, we'll be learning about the notes and categories of essential oils, blending for effectiveness, blending for aroma, diluting, and bottling. The note of essential oil has to do with how quickly the essential oil will evaporate. Top note essential oils typically evaporate in one to three hours, while a middle note could last as long as three to five hours. Base notes create the foundation for great blends, and the aroma can last for more than a day after being applied. You may have applied a blend to your skin and notice that the aroma changes over time as top and middle notes will evaporate first. At the top of each product description page on jadebloom.com, you will find the note listed for each essential oil. As you begin creating your own blends, we recommend starting with one essential oil from each note. As you become more comfortable with your unique creations, then you can begin to add additional oils in perfecting its effectiveness for your body and its aroma. The only thing better than creating a custom healing blend of oils for your body is creating a custom blend that also has the aroma you're targeting for you and for those around you to enjoy all day long. A good rule of thumb to follow in the beginning with your ratios is 25% top note, 55% middle note, and 20% base note. Essential oils within the same category typically blend well together. We hate to give you too many recommendations or general rules to follow here because there are always exceptions. Rather, for your reference, we will give you some examples of different categories and some essential oils that fall under those categories. When creating your own custom blend, the effectiveness of that blend for your body should be your first consideration. Nobody knows your body better than you do, and you may have discovered some unique positive responses to some essential oils that you want to include with your blend. Perfect! That's the very reason the Oil University encourages people to explore making their own blends. To supplement your own experience, we have created a resource that could also be helpful in deciding which oils to include in your blend. You can turn to our online uses guide for some additional recommendations to try. For example, let's say you found some relief to arthritis using turmeric essential oil, but you would like to try to create a blend to increase the effectiveness on your arthritis. On the uses guide, you can find arthritis listed next to turmeric. When you click on the word arthritis, you'll discover the list of essential oils that have been known to help with arthritis. Carrot seed, frankincense, marjoram, pine needle, rosemary, and wintergreen. Now using the basics in creating blends as we have just discussed, you can possibly discover some additional relief for arthritis by creating your own custom blend. The possibilities really are endless and you'll find new open doors to all natural healing that you never knew existed. We consider this next step as fine tuning your blend. Once you have perfected the effectiveness of your blend, you should decide if you love the aroma. Your perfected blend may already smell amazing and not need fine tuning. However, you may decide you would like it a little more woodsy undertone or a more citrusy overtone. Once you become familiar with the different essential oil categories, you will get a better feel for what your creation is lacking based on your preference. Adding an additional essential oil for aroma rarely changes the effectiveness of what you already perfected. So be brave and take some chances. Depending on your blend and how you're using it, diluting it may or may not be required or desired. If you do require or desire dilution, then we recommend first looking through the properties of possible carrier oils that you could use to increase the effectiveness while providing some dilution. And secondly, you should consider how that carrier oil might change the aroma of your blend. In continuing with the example of our custom arthritis blend, we could try and use black cumin seed oil that is known for its analgesic properties. This would provide adequate dilution if needed while potentially increasing the effectiveness of the blend as a whole for arthritis. If dilution is needed but you're not interested in changing the effectiveness or the aroma of your perfected blend, then we recommend using refined jojoba or grapeseed as both of these oils work great as a carrier without changing the aroma of your perfected blend. Now that you have the perfect custom formulation for your body, the last step is deciding the type of bottle you would like to use to store it in. As with all essential oils, we recommend that you use dark colored glass containers to help protect the chemical composition and the healing compounds. Next, 
decide how you will be applying the oil and choose a convenient bottle that will make it easy to use daily. Jade Bloom offers several different types of empty bottles for this very purpose. These include a Euro dropper top for easy one-handed dispensing drop by drop, a glass pipette for larger disbursement of your oil, or a glass roller ball top for smooth roll-on application to your skin. Creating your own blends should be fun, but never overwhelming or frustrating. Be sure never to use more than 10 to 15 drops of each oil in case you're not happy with the final product so you don't waste more oil than needed in your experimentations. Take careful notes of your creations and label them well so you can recreate that perfect blend once you've discovered it. Remember, have fun and happy blending.